Good morning. Today is November 2nd, 2021. It is time for your tarot therapy. I have already shuffled and selected the cards. I had a little camera issue, so I had to start the film again, but trust me, they have been shuffled and they were randomly picked. The first card we got was the Eight of Pentacles, and that represents you've been working hard. You've been working towards a goal, or you've been working at the same job for a long time, but whatever it is, you've been sticking with it. You've been committed. You've worked very hard. You've built up your um, reputation, your business, your clientele, your finances, whatever, but you've been working hard towards a goal. But I see a Ten of Wands that pops up, and that tells me that you're ready for something new. You're going to pick up the pieces. The Wands represent your desires, hopes, and dreams. You're going to start over again. You're going to, you need to pick up the pieces, no matter what happened in the past, and go forward with this new energy, this new idea. I think I even brought that up yesterday, so it keeps coming up new, new, new. So um, maybe it's time for, for some reflection as to what's going on in your life and where, where are you missing your fulfillment. Um, then out of the intuitive cards, we picked the innocence card. And I want to tell you a very quick story. My brother, when he was little, we were interviewing him on a tape recorder. That tells you how old I am. <laughs> and we were asking him little questions. It was really cute. He was like four maybe. And we said to him, what would you like to be when you grow up? And he very plainly said, I'd like to be a taxi cab. And we said, you mean a taxi driver? He says, no, the cab. I like taxi cabs. And we said, well, you can be anything you want, but it has to be alive. So he says, okay. And after careful thought, he says, I want to be a puppy. Who wouldn't want to be a puppy, right? They're cute and they're lovable and sweet and they make everybody smile. And I know that's a silly story, but you know what? When we're kids, we don't edit ourselves. I want, I challenge you not to edit yourself. I want you to remember or even think about anything that you ever wanted in your life. If you want to fly, if you want to float, if you want to uh, dance, if you want to sing, whatever it may be, don't edit yourself. Be who you are because you know what? Nobody is like you and you're amazing. Uh, then we get the reflection card, which I just said to you. Reflect on your life. Look back and say, what really makes me happy? What really floats my boat, so to speak, right? Uh, for me, I, I've always loved entertaining. I've always loved um, acting, singing, dancing, uh, being funny, talking. I'm a talker. If anyone knows me, they know. Um, and, and it just all kind of fell into place when my um, psychic abilities started to grow and I was helping a lot of people. And all I thought is, I could do this all day. I just love helping people. So find your, find your calling. Find the thing that you love to do and start, just think about it. You don't have to do anything. Just think about it, okay? I, I ask you. So everybody, have a wonderful Tuesday. I love you all. We kept it there in three minutes. Yay! See you tomorrow.